What's up guys, it's Koi from Gentleman Within and in this video we're going to be taking a look at eight high quality undershirt brands, how they feel, fit, and the best in a myriad of different categories. Let's get started. If you want to learn about the hallmarks of a high quality undershirt and more about the brands featured in this video, you can head on over to the article. I'll have it linked down below for your convenience. First up on the list of best undershirts for men is Uniqlo. I've had my Uniqlo Heat Tech undershirts for several years now. They've been through countless wash and dry cycles, although I started to hang dry them more recently so that they last longer. And they do shrink slightly, so be aware of that. I wear them year round as a base layer under my thicker shirts and sweaters in the winter and in warmer weather under a lightweight vest, for example. The shirts fit me like a muscle fit, which is the way an undershirt is meant to fit. It's snug all over from the chest, through the body, and around my biceps. It's actually a little bit too tight and the sleeves are a little bit short for my liking. I might be able to get away with sizing up to a small here. It's got just the right amount of elasticity and it's easy to tuck into my pants or boxer briefs. Additionally, it's got a pretty slim collar around the neck for a sleeker appearance. A problem area with the shirt though is that one of the crew neck collars has lost its shape a little bit. But bacon collar aside, I've got to say that they've held up really well over the course of the past few years. It looks like they've since updated the shirt design since I purchased mine. Instead of a tag on the collar, the undershirts are now tagless, and it looks like the shirts are now longer to make for an easier tuck. Uniqlo's Heat Tech long sleeve t-shirts are essentially the same as their short sleeve shirts, except with the long sleeves, which makes them the perfect undergarment for colder weather. I particularly like to wear them as a base layer while snowboarding or other winter activities. It's lightweight enough to allow for full mobility and still does a good job of insulating to keep my core warm up on the mountain. Just like my short sleeve shirts, I've had my long sleeve undershirts from Uniqlo for many years now. They've been through countless wash and dry cycles and are holding up well. The long sleeve undershirts fit just like the short sleeve shirts too and the sleeves are slightly shorter than full length sleeves so that they stay hidden under your outer layers. Finally, the V-neck heat tech shirts have a deeper V-cut that's intended to keep the shirt hidden under dress shirts. And just like the short sleeve shirt, the collar is trimmer than most undershirts that I've worn. The bottom line is that Uniqlo offers the most affordable undershirt options out of every brand in this video, coming in at under $15, making it the best value undershirt money can buy. Next up is the Twillery Performance Undershirt. Twillery's performance undershirts come in a crew neck or v-neck variety in white or tan tonal color. I personally prefer the tonal undershirt as it blends with my skin tone as opposed to the contrast of a white, though white is still a perfectly fine option. On the back of the shirt under the neck is a silver reflective Twillery T logo printed, which is a welcome design detail. Their performance shirts are made with a sweat wicking cooling technology and sleeves that don't ride up into my armpits. And it's got a length that's appropriate to wear untucked or tucked in. Out of all the undershirts in this roundup, Twillery's performance undershirt feels and fits the most like a t-shirt. The fabric feels thicker and a bit more substantial. It could easily be worn casually as a standalone shirt during a light run or workout or as a moisture wicking base layer worn under an Oxford shirt. Talk about versatility. It might be a little bit too loose fitting for some to wear as an undershirt, but I still think that it's a pretty decent option. The bottom line is that the Twillery Performance undershirt is the best option that you can wear casually and comfortably as a t-shirt, and it has all the beneficial properties that you'd want in an undershirt as well. Number three on the list of best undershirts for men is the Evo Tensile Deep V-neck undershirt. Rib T's Evo Tensile undershirt is made with a 94% tensile fabric, which is ultra soft and an excellent cooling material. These shirts are a perfect balance of fit and function. Their undershirts are made with a lightweight and breathable material. It's also rather sheer and even a little bit see-through, which is good or bad depending on your preference. It's so light that sometimes it feels like you're wearing nothing at all, which is a huge benefit in my eyes. There are several reasons why this undershirt is the best no-show option in this roundup. One, the lightweight fabric and longer shirt length makes it optimal for tucking in and staying tucked in. Two, the deep v-neck and thin material ensures that it always stays hidden under your top layers. Three, the tan color option helps to keep it more discreet under white dress shirts. Four, the neckline is more trimmed than any other undershirt I've worn. And five, the raglan sleeve design provides a more seamless fit. Rib tee undershirts come in a crew neck or deep v-neck and in a white, light gray, or tan color option. They don't carry anything smaller than small or larger than extra large, which could be unfortunate for some, but there's so much stretch to these shirts that most men are likely covered. In my experience, the size small fits me well. I'm 5'6", 135 pounds for reference 
And finally, rib tee undershirts do not shrink in a wash and dry cycle. The bottom line is that rib tees undershirts are not only the best no-show in this roundup, but they're also some of the most comfortable and high quality on the market. I've worn their Evo Tensil undershirts for years now and recommend them highly. Next up is the Tanny Silk Cut undershirt. Similar to Twillery, the Tanny Silk Cut undershirt can be worn both as a base layer and a basic tee. I'd say that their undershirt has the most flowy drape and some of the nicest feeling fabric that I've ever felt on a shirt. It's just got a super soft and buttery smooth texture and feeling. I got size medium, which is too long to wear as a t-shirt, but it makes for an excellent undershirt option. It's form-fitting with naturally moisture-wicking fabric. The micromodal air fabric is softer and thinner than silk and is less see-through than Rip Tees Evo Tensile shirt. Additionally, tanny fabrics can keep you warm when it's cool and cool when it's warm. Just the type of versatility that you want from an undergarment or t-shirt. I also have a set of their Silk Cut Thermal underwear and it's especially true of the long sleeve thermals that I've been wearing to bed as pajamas during the cooler months. I want to mention that it's not the best undershirt to wear if you want to keep hidden. The crew neck is cut close around the neck while the v-neck isn't deep enough to remain hidden under some unbuttoned dress shirts. Finally, the shirt did not shrink through a wash and dry cycle. The bottom line is that when it comes to how it feels and fits, Tanny's Silk Cut shirt is one of my favorites. And the micromodal air technology is something you'll want to feel for yourself. If you're getting value out of this video, could you do me a quick favor and hit that like button? It really does help the channel grow. Big thanks, now back to the video. Number five best undershirts for men is the premium tailored v-neck undershirt from Mr. Davis. The Mr. Davis undershirts come in a tailored or traditional fit which makes it well fitting for a multitude of body types. I personally prefer the tailored cut as it follows the shape of my body and provides a more streamlined fit. It has a similar style and design to the Rib T Evo Tensile undershirt in that there's a tan option as well as the raglan sleeves. It's thicker though with a noticeably wider neckline trim. It also has the regular crew neck or tailored v-neck undershirt options in four colors of white, gray, black, or tonal. Mr. Davis is the only undershirt brand in this list that's made primarily with bamboo viscose, which gives it a soft, silky feeling and appearance, along with keeping me really cool. Additionally, the 6% spandex provides ample stretch. The problem area I noticed with the shirt, and I'm not sure if it's simply a minor defect, but the fabric at the back collar of the shirt behind my neck tends to bunch up a little bit over time. I only noticed this occurred after I put the shirt through a wash and dry cycle. The shirt didn't shrink though. The bottom line, whether Mr. Davis undershirts are the best in the world as they say, that's up for debate, but these bamboo constructed shirts are some of the coolest and most comfortable on the market. My recommendation is the tonal color, which is the best option for most skin tones. Next up with the best design is the Manual Outfitters The Base Layer. Manual Outfitters The Base Layer comes in a performance blend of fabrics from Eucalyptus Origin. It's lyocell, cotton, and elastane. It's made with a proprietary seam design that helps break tension under your arms, providing free range of motion. It's more so along the lines of performance and active gear rather than a plain undershirt. When you wear the shirt, you can feel the difference from ordinary tees and undershirts. The seams on the arms provide a performance tech feel. It's a shirt you're going to want to work out in. I like the way that the shirt fits and is perfect to be worn under your favorite button downs or standalone as a basic tee although it's better suited as a base layer as its name suggests. It's got a refined clean fit. What's cool is that they have a less medium and more medium size, which is ideal for those who may be in between small and medium or between medium and large. It comes in two colors of clean white or black, and the shirt may shrink slightly in a wash and dry cycle. The bottom line is that Manual Outfitters The Base Layer has an exceptional design that's unlike any of the shirts in this roundup. You'll feel the difference the second that you put this shirt on. If you like to work out and want to look good while you're at it, the base layer is a great option. And now number seven best undershirts for men is Organic Basics Soft Touch Tensile Light Tee. Similar to Twillery and Tanny, the Organic Basics Soft Touch Tensile Light Tee is designed as a base layer that wears well as a plain tee. This tensile tee is a soft undershirt that's made with eco-friendly wood pulp fiber called tensile, which we've mentioned before, and it's softer and lighter than cotton because of the smaller fibers. It feels similar to silk, spandex, or bamboo fabric, and it has a more silky feeling than Rib Tees Evo Tensile shirts. In terms of the shirt's design, there's a slight v-neck and the shirt is fitted throughout from the chest down through the arms and the waist. I personally feel that the shirt fits my body quite nicely. The Organic Basics undershirt comes in black, white, and navy colors. There's also a dark green that I have a preference towards and is different from all the other colors offered by any other brands. The bottom line is that Organic Basics is transparent about where their products are sourced from, which is admirable in a world where many brands choose to omit those facts. 
it's a premium product at a premium price. If you're looking for high quality basics, organic basics is definitely worth a look. And finally, number eight, the best undershirt for men, also offers the best sweat protection, it's Thompson T. The Thompson T sweat proof undershirt, while technically an undershirt, it might fit you well as a t-shirt too, depending on your build. For me, the shirt was huge out of the packaging, but I was surprised that it shrunk down considerably after a single wash and high heat dry cycle. Thompson T is hands down the best undershirt for sweat, because it comes with a proprietary design that stops sweat from showing through your underarms, which is a lifesaver for those who suffer from hyperhidrosis or just tend to sweat a lot in general. I have to be honest, it feels a little weird having that extra padding under your arms, and while it's not uncomfortable, but it does take some getting used to. You can definitely feel the protection though. In terms of the tops and tee as an undershirt, it's a little bit too heavy weight of a fabric for an undershirt in my opinion, especially the sweat panels under the arms. And so that's why I recommend it as a t-shirt. Your mileage may vary though, depending on your build. For reference, I'm 5'6", 135 pounds. The bottom line, if you want a t-shirt or undershirt with sweatproof technology that's made in the USA with quality fabrics, Thompson Tee is the perfect shirt for you. I hope you enjoyed this video. Some of the undershirts I bought with my own money, while others were provided as samples. And so I wanna thank those brands for sending samples along for me to test out. Thank you as always for watching. I have another video for you right here and right here. So go and check one of those out. If you're new here, consider subscribing. I put out new videos like this weekly. That's all I got for this video. Cheers to your style. Smash that like button and I will catch you on the next one. Peace.